Hi, uh, he's in rough shape. The homeowner had called saying that his kitten had shown up in his yard. Get you. He'd been feeding it, but yeah, I just wanted it gone. Yeah. My husband just looked at me and said, let's just go get it. Want me to get him? He was back in the pile of trash. He couldn't stand up. He could barely lift his head. He was small. I could feel the, his bones, his ribs. And that it looked like the kitten may have lost its tail. We needed to get him help pretty quickly. So we got the kitten and we are headed home right now. Uh, it's Sunday, so our vet's closed first thing in the morning. Um, if he does survive, we'll go ahead and get him into the vet. In the morning, I was very pleased to see Julius that made it through the night. But he's got flea dander and dirt all over. So. And they said, yeah, this is, this is pretty bad. Keep fighting. Got him as cleaned out as they possibly could and then all bandaged up. He just had, from the start, just the sweetest personality. Just a little cat that wants love. The healing process had indeed started. You could tell he was feeling so much better. Oh, that's my dog. There's the happy little boy. Probably for the first time in his life, he was safe, he was warm, he was fed, and he was comfortable. As we progressed from day to day, it just got easier and easier for him. Rob is my son, and he saw Julius and just immediately fell in love with him. <laughs> what are you doing? And had told us early on that he would be interested in adopting him. He came out of his little sleeping area, jumped in my lap. From that point, he told us that we were his tiny shaved butt cat who was just the, the most gregarious, cute thing I've ever seen. Hey, who's gonna clean this up, Julius? Oh my goodness, the experience has been wonderful. He's giving her a bath. What a sweet boy. He's a diehard Saints fan. Loves to sit there and watch football. He just wanted to live and he wanted to be loved and we're fortunate enough to be the ones that get to give it to him. It's amazing what such a tiny creature can overcome.